In this example, I will show you how to upload and uh, launch a SCORM course into your site. Of course, your administrator would have to do this unless um, you were given rights to upload um, courses. But um, this is how I do it. I'm going to go into my courses area under my administration panel, and I've got this from the administrator's view. And I'm going to add edit courses. And I'm just going to go into my workshop area category. And I'm going to add, um, I'm going to upload a file to add a course. So I'm going to add a new course. And the name of my course, it's going to be Golf Explained. Golf Explained. And I'm going to give it the same short name. Just a moment. Oh dear. And I'm going to put it here. Okay, and I'm just going to leave everything as it is. I'm not going to make any changes right now. But I want the SCORM format. So this is under the format. I'm going to go under the SCORM format. And I'm going to save changes. This is where I would assign a teacher. And I will, because um, I've got the administrator's view right now, I will put my dog in as the teacher. And that is Squirt. I'm looking for Squirt's name. Whoops, excuse me. There he is. And I'm going to bring that over. And okay, so that's Squirt as the teacher. I'm going to go back to the course. And then you see I get this continue link. I'm going to click on the continue link. And then I have to give this a name for this object and it's golf and again golf I'm just keeping this simple right now I'd spend a little bit more time being careful and this is where I choose or upload a file so I'm going to choose or upload a file it immediately goes into the files area of where my course is but I'm going to upload a file so I choose the file and it is this course here that I want it's in a zip format of course open that and I upload this file. We'll just give that a moment or two. So what it's doing is it's uploading the, the SCORM and now I get the choice to unzip it, list it, restore it, rename it. Well the one that's highlight, choose, that's what you want. We want to choose this SCORM package. There I go and I'm going to leave all the defaults as they are and then I click the save and display button and I get this here and I can um, preview my course if I go enter, it might take a moment or two to load. And there you go. And it's got buttons to navigate. And I'll make a copy of this in our Moodle, Moot, um, our Moodle Meet area so you can have a look at the whole course there. Um, and I'll do that now.